What are you doing? Nothing! I'm just... Working on a car! Need to tune up! Work on the car later, you dummy. Your food has been making food to see you. Coming! So, tell me all about this. When I said to make it, then it took effect. I'm thinking about me marketing our kitchen. I know. We should celebrate with my weird wing meatloaf. You still in it, Tony? Ugh, you'll never guess that that stupid dog makes food fit to my garden. That mongrel dog doesn't look like the penis. Can't I hear the police? Oh, I should take a kiss to make the kitchen. Good evening, ma'am. We're with the LBPD. Is something wrong? Sorry to bother you, but do you mind if we step inside for a minute? Of course. Let me get my husband. Excuse me. Jack? Jack! The police are here. Do you know what's going on? Jack? Why do you use that blank stare? Jack! Well, what a lovely home you have here. I wish I could afford something like this on a cop's salary. <laughs> Thank you. What's your chance when you like some coffee? Thank you, ma'am, but we currently do not have the time. We are in the middle of an investigation. Oh, okay. So... Let me introduce us. I'm Detective Johnson, and this is Detective Miller. I'm Tracy Stewart, and this is my husband, Jack. Let's cut to the chase. Have you seen this man before? I could think I've ever seen him before. How about you, sir? What? Uh, no! <laughs> Doesn't ring a bell. So, who is he? Name's John Poe. He murdered six people and was serving three consecutive life sentences. We've arrested him before, but last night, he escaped from the transfer bus while en route to a new prison. Oh my. We got an anonymous tip that he was in the area. We are doing everything we can to bring him in. So if you see him, stay away. Lock your doors and call 911 immediately. He's a homicidal maniac. Okay. Well, 
that's about it. Sorry again for disturbing you folks. Let's go, Miller. Miller? What happened to your hand, sir? What? Your hand. It's bleeding. Huh? Oh, this isn't my blood. Not your blood, sir? Huh? I mean, oh! It must be my blood! Ow! I must have cut myself somehow! Ah! Must have happened while working on the car! Thank you for your cooperation. Box, we offer our best deals from our own American shopper for only $4.99. Only at Jack in the Box. Here, cash a room in New York, courtesy by Mr. Kaboom. Thanks, bitch.
I'm scared, Jack. We need to make sure that Amy stays in her room. No, times like this, I wish she wasn't dead. Amy, sweetie, look at mommy. Stay in the room and lock the windows, okay? Jack, let me see your hand. Is it bleeding? Jack! Ugh, I'm fine, Tracy. Don't treat me like a child. What the heck is this problem tonight? He was alive? Where is he? No! Tracy? 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 Where are you? Too, Jack. Hey, how are you doing in life? I could swear my lips are here. Tracy, we need to leave right now. Huh? What are you talking about? Just listen to me! Now, where's Amy? She's upstairs. Okay, you stay here. I'll be right. No, we can't split up. Oh God. Just follow me! Okay, baby? Jack, that's enough! What are you babbling about? Talk to me! We don't have time! Please! Just trust me! Once we're on the road, I'll explain everything! But we need to go get Amy right now! Jack, just tell me! Just listen to me, woman! We need to get out of here before! What? Where is it? Tracy? Don't turn around. Chloe, get behind me now. What? Quickly, Tracy. Just get over here. Jack? Where's everyone, Jack?